Six and four Iowa State travels to Norman, Oklahoma to play the Oklahoma Sooners coming off their first loss of the season. Oklahoma is a four-point favorite in this game. But the question is for Oklahoma, who's going to play quarterback? Is it going to be Spencer Rattler? Is it going to be Caleb Williams? Is it going to be a combination of both? That's a dilemma that head coach Lincoln Riley has to face this week. But one thing they can rest assured on, running back Kennedy Brooks has done a heck of a job this season, rushing for over 800 yards, almost six yards a carry, and 10 touchdowns on the season. But for Iowa State, this is a team that everyone who thought the preseason coach was going to be a top 10 football team. They just lost their last game in the last seconds by a 62-yard field goal to Texas Tech. But Brock Purdy has done his part. He's completed almost 73% of his passes. Brees Hall, again, is over 1,000 yards rushing in his career, and he has 16 rushing touchdowns on the season. I'm going to go with the Sooners to bounce back in this game because I always thought the Sooners were probably a playoff team. Maybe they'll get it together. They've had too many close games this year, but I'm taking Oklahoma to win this game and cover 34-26. to 26. Iowa State has been disappointing, Mark, on certain weeks. Other weeks, they've played outstanding. They beat Oklahoma State, so it tells you. And they have two of the best players in the conference, as you mentioned, Brock Purdy. Uh, I just really love him. He's a senior. And I think running back Hall is one of the best in the country. You mentioned 16 touchdowns, but he also has almost 1,200 yards rushing. The defense for Iowa State is very good and probably one of the better ones in the conference. Now we look at Oklahoma. I know how disappointed they were last week. Now, Baylor beat them last week. Will Baylor beat them again this week because they're worried about what happened last week? I'm not sure who the quarterback will be. I think it would have been Williams, except he got his hand stepped on when he was sliding out of bounds last week. And that certainly curtailed his activities in the game. Uh, you look at uh, Spencer Rayler, very good quarterback, but I don't know who's going to be. Uh, the players, I think, really want William. Now, the problem with Oklahoma, Mark, they don't have many big play individuals that we're used to seeing the wide receivers in an open field, et cetera. And they have to play Oklahoma State as, as well. This is the last home game of the year. I'd say that Iowa State has always played them very well, Mark. And because of that, I'm going to predict Oklahoma or Iowa State to beat Oklahoma 34, Oklahoma 31 in an upset. 